This is Red Man. I'm back in this video and this topic. I'm talking about women have lots of options to have sex, like, but don't have lots of options when it comes to relationships. Because this is the thing a lot of men already woke up to what women do in relationships. Like, they understand these women ain't loyal. Like, <laughs> when Chris Brown and Lil Wayne made the song, These Ain't Loyal. You know, like, that really broke the internet, I say, like, with that song right there. And I know it really resonated with a whole bunch of men, you know what I'm saying? So men, I mean, even from, you know, from the point back, you know what I'm saying? Like, even before the song, like, through these years progressing, men have started waking up. And saying they not want, they don't want to be in a relationship with these women because they know they three or fours, like they could be dressed up and trying to act like a sophisticated, like a nice sweet woman, but she has so many men she done slept with. Cause just think about like women that you went to school with. I just say okay, I'm forty. Right. Any woman that's forty around my age that you know and. Ain't no telling, like, for the average woman, how many bodies she have on her. <sighs> the average. You got to remember, like, there's a lot of women, especially, I'm going to just say, in my time, like, you know, when they was old enough to go to bars and clubs. Well, you know, they just sneak in the bars and clubs when they was younger, you know, getting the fake ID to get in the bar, you know, or a club. <laughs> At the age of like 15, 16 years old and stuff like that. But, you know, they would lose their regenerative around, you know, somewhere around that age, 15, 16, something like that. Uh, a lot so. But you got to imagine like from 16, let's just say 16 to 40. Think how many men she done slept with. Just men she done slept with. Not how many times she done had sex. How many men she done slept with. Like... The average woman, I would have to say, she done slept. I'm just saying, a girl that goes out to bars and clubs, being nice, reasonable, I would say at least, <laughs> I say at least 50. At least 50 different guys. Now, for the ones to say, okay, I had a relationship. You know, I was in a relationship with this guy for one year. Well, you know, like some of them would say like five, six years. But I promise you, when they was in that relationship with that guy, they were sleeping with other men too. You got to realize that too. Like, I know a lot of men just not finding out that, okay, if you even get into a relationship with a woman nowadays, like, okay, you can actually attempt to get into a relationship with her. But she gonna be sleeping with other men too while she in a relationship. That's the thing. And uh, even back then, when them girls say, "Okay, I, I had a relationship for five years, ten years," they've been sleeping with other men too while they was with you. Majority, I would go back and say at least about eighty-five to ninety percent. That that's how worse it is. Like men just now starting to really wake up on that point. You know, cause they couldn't imagine a woman going out there sleeping with another guy and stuff like that. Especially like, say for instance, you know, even like if she was a stay-at-home mom or something like that. Women used to sneak men uh, to their house and stuff while they boyfriend, well, it's supposed to be husband, but you know, in this case, they boyfriend if they get into a relationship, you know, the man or the woman get into a relationship nowadays, they still say boyfriend and shit, you know. But yeah. At least on the nice side, 50 different men by the age of 40. Now, we know it's way more women now that have actually probably been with at least 200 men by the time she hit 40 years old. 200 different men, you know, especially them girls, especially uh, who just like to go out and just, you know, Party, you know, party and bullshit, basically. <laughs> uh, the women right there, they, they done 
I know they at least got 200 bodies on them by the time they hit 40. But yeah, lots of men have woke up to it. Women have options, that plenty of options to have sex with different guys, but the option of a relationship is very, very small. Because those guys hold a gateway to relationship, women hold a gateway to sex. And that's how it always been. <laughs> so, and you know, the minute the more women sleep around with different guys and stuff like that, and the more um, she don't value sex like that. That's why shit. Um, a lot of content creators they be talking about now, women are monetized and stuff like that. I mean, we understand the whole concept of taking care of a woman and stuff like that. Being in a relationship, you're going to have to spend money. You know what I'm saying? I understand that that dynamic and that um, scenario. But this woman has to be basically helping you out, being supportive of you, you know, doing things for you, you know, for you to be just spending money on her like that. That's the thing. Like, it ain't no equality when it comes to men and women. Like, we're not the same. The man is the leader. The woman is supposed to be following the man. So that's how it's supposed to be. <laughs> but yeah, they're going to find out the hard way. You know, I would say, men, y'all, stay on y'all purpose, stay on y'all grind and stuff. Uh, and women, this is why I tell women, like, okay, you see how many guys you can slept with. Now, it's time for you to be serious and actually put yourself out there and get with a good man that will take care of you as far as like, you know, provide for you and stuff like that. But you have to be on that man's program. Can man ain't finna put up with you, you know, acting like you just, I mean, totally independent and stuff. Like that's why the whole thing about concubines is very very good and important right now like because women working just like men work so you know i would just say the best advice is like okay the, the man have his own spot the woman have her own spot she working he working now the goal is really to be self-sufficient like to come up with ideas for you can work for yourself that's where it's the most important thing like Instead of working these nine to five and stuff, I always should be trying to shoot for working for yourself or working online some way. I mean, you can work remotely or something, so you can kind of work at your time, you know. Uh, but yeah, women, I say y'all have to get start getting serious. Y'all really want a relationship. Like you see all of these dating apps, women be saying, "Ah, oh, they look for a relationship, looking for a relationship, looking for a relationship," but. We know a lot of women just, even when they on the now, they're just sleeping around with different guys. But they're just trying to find a sucker that's going to say, okay, I want to get a relationship too with, you know, with someone. Maybe it'll be you. Their love here, there, right there. But yeah, man, don't fall for it. Women have to come and bring what they're supposed to to the table. All right, man. And women. <laughs> Y'all have a blessed night. I'm out.